everybody. I've been making these almond flour tortillas lately that are very keto friendly. And I was going to show you how I make the recipe and then what I make with these tortillas. To start out, we add one cup of almond flour, one tablespoon of xanthan gum, a half a teaspoon baking powder, a pinch of salt, one large egg, and one tablespoon of water. Once we add all of our ingredients, then we'll start to mix it. Once we get all of our ingredients combined like this, then what we'll do is we'll go ahead and knead the dough a little bit and get it uh, all mixed really good and really incorporate the xanthan gum in there. Once we get this all done, then we're going to set it aside for about 15 minutes, let the xanthan gum do its thing. The xanthan gum works really good at making the tortillas pliable after they're cooked, so you can basically do a lot of things with them. So let's let this set for a few minutes and then we'll get started rolling out our dough. To start out with, you'll roll your dough into balls. I have five that I was able to roll out, but what happens is after you start rolling your tortillas, then there's always a little bit left over. You set that dough aside and then you make more tortillas. So you, I always end up getting about seven tortillas and these are like small taco size. My next step is I got a piece of parchment paper and take one of the balls and place it on the parchment paper. And then I usually smash it down a little bit to get it started. And then I'll take my rolling pin and get a little bit more room to work here. And then I will roll this out until it's really thin because uh, it raises a little bit when it's cooking. So I want it to start out really thin. But guys, these tortillas are wonderful. If you're on keto especially, they're super keto friendly. I'll put the nutritional information down at the bottom. But you see this rolled out to be like that size. But what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to trim it into like a small uh, tortilla. So and you see that you have the excess that just peels away. And then I will just put it aside over here so I can roll that out into a, another tortilla. But look at look at how super thin these are. They're really thin when you start out. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to take it over to my pan and I'm going to put it in my pan and heat it on both sides until it's a little bit uh, golden brown. And then um, they're pretty much done from there. I already have my pan heating up. so. You just put it in your pan like that. And then you'll be able to see that it's uh, starting to get a little bit of bubbles on it there. I'll give it a, a second longer but they cook really fast. Basically, you just have to brown them a little bit on both sides. Okay, they're ready. This is what they look like when they're done. The tortilla, it's just like barely golden brown, but you see how pliable it is? They're really good for tacos, like soft tacos. Um, I made tacos last night. I made enchiladas the night before and taquitos I've made with them. And also uh, breakfast burritos. I, they're kind of like a, almost like a soft taco burrito though. I usually I'll put scrambled eggs and ham or bacon or sausage and, and cheese and salsa and uh, makes a really good little breakfast um, treat there. Sometimes when they're still warm, what we do, We'll just put butter on them and eat them like this. They're pretty yummy. Hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching. Bye.